Hey, my beautiful G3 family. Welcome back to God is Guidance. And to all my new viewers, thank you so, so much for tuning in. Welcome to God is Guidance. My name is Jasmine, but you can call me the Lemurian Goddess. And I'm here to bring you guys just a timeless pull, a timeless general energy check, okay? So whenever you click on this video, this message, it just might be for you. If not, it's all good. You can always book a reading with your sis. We'll go deeper into your energy and see what mother wants to tell you. Um, Sorry for the noises and the sounds. My window is wide open, so you know you're gonna hear all of the stuff that's going on outside. Um, please like, share, and subscribe. Yes, join the G3 family. I would love to have you. Uh, and and I see y'all getting them lights up. Ah! Okay, okay, enough, enough, right? <laughs> Not every video, Jasmine, but I'm telling you, I'm so excited. <laughs> but um, and let me tell you, one video can have 14, and the next one have 15, and I'm in. D that that's how it 13 we'll have 13 we'll have 14 we'll have 15 and i'm in so like oh look at them look at the growth <laughs> let me tell you those little wins matter okay the little wins add up to some big behind wins so yes that one extra like i get i am in here lit okay i'm happy <laughs> look 144 the chosen ones yeah i'm talking to my chosen ones Ah, yeah, I'm gonna be pulling from my um from a, a, the deck that I made. I'm gonna get a few cards, uh, and yeah, we'll, we'll dig into this energy. Um, as I was meditating over the energy, I felt like somebody is under a lot of pressure, and maybe they need to go on a trip. That's what I was getting. It's time to take a trip. It's time to relax your, your mind. It's a whole lot of pressure. I feel like people like to, like to to have you under pressure. People like to keep you under pressure. But I feel like mother is trying to release this pressure from you. So um, take a trip. Or maybe you're just your job is, is just very stressful. It's time to take a trip, okay? It's time to take a trip. Um, I feel like your intuition has been telling you, too, to, like, slow down. I'm going on vacation. Focus on you. Tap into your self-love. I feel like your intuition has been telling you take some like take some time out for yourself. But it's like every time you know um, you probably try to do something, something comes up, something happens. Let me tell you something. It's forces in this universe that's going against you. So it's like you got to make it a priority. Put yourself first. Like, make yourself a priority. So even when things come up in your life, even when things, like, you try to do something and this come up, and it's like, nah, I'm going to deal with that when I come back from doing what I got to do. Like, stop putting other people, other things, and other places before you. Now, I can see if it's your children. And even then, still, it's like you got to find balance with that. Because you, you can't just keep putting your children before you because then you're not going to have time for yourself. You're going to be drained. Um, you're, you're not going to be, a, a, what is it? You're not going to be in the mental state to be a, like, you know, to help, help your children because you're going to be all jacked up. You're not going to be solid. We need you to be solid. That's what Mother said. Mother said we need you to be solid. And being solid is knowing how and when to put yourself first. So somebody has to release this pressure and take a trip. Okay? So I don't know who that's for. But thank you, Mother, for the messages that has already come through as we dig deeper into this energy. What is going on with my beautiful G3 collective? What do you want to tell them? What do they need to know? A woman's word. Whew. Somebody realize. A woman's word right oh somebody realized your worth in jail whose story is that oh protection is out here first card out somebody is heavily heavily protected sigils mm. You're heavily protected right now. I feel like your ancestors, your guides are all around you, all right? Um, we have Sigil, Aries, Sing, Rap, Wolf in Sheep's Clothing, May, February, Created, Master, Manifester, Perfectionist. Okay. Heavy on the protection. I don't know if you're if you are an Aries that's being protected or you're being protected from an Aries. 
but somebody is in this controlling behind energy that mother is protecting you from. I feel like um, your ancestors, your guides, mother is saying to up your protection. So with these sigils here, learn how to do sigils. Learn how to, um, because at the end of the day, I feel like this is this is really a war, you know. And and if you're going to um, be in this, you know, d d doing this spiritual walk and and be, being the um, the god of your your world, you're gonna have to to know how to become an alchemist. You're going to have to know how to transmute energy. You're going to have to know how to work with the energy. You're going to have to know how to protect yourself. You're going to have to know what herbs and stuff to you. It's like, this is, this is, it's not for play play. This is something, this is serious. So I feel like somebody has to get serious. Yes, you you are protected in the spiritual realm. Yes, you have your you know mother and your guides and stuff protecting you, but you still need to protect yourself here in this physical 3D. It's like, yeah, you know, your guides and your ancestors are protecting you. But when you get in that car, they also tell you to put on your seatbelt. It's like that. So, okay. You know, you got all of this. Um, your ancestors is big, bad. Because I'm seeing them. Your ancestors are big and bad. They don't play that. And especially when it comes to you. Okay? But they're saying that it's time for you to do your part as well. So do some sigils. Sigils are signs of protection that you can put around your house. It's symbols. Sigils are symbols of protection that you can put around your house, that you can put, you know, that, and it's for you. Now you can go online and you can look up sigils, but the mother is saying for, um, for, 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 if you want it to be more successful or yeah, yeah, you have to do it, okay? So like I said, I feel like maybe you, you are you can, you can are an Aries. I could be talking to an Aries. Um, or you're being protected from an Aries, all right? Um, with this sing and rap here, what I'm, what I'm getting is maybe somebody sings or raps. Maybe this Aries sings and rap. Or maybe your, your singing or rap career is being protected right now because somebody is trying to stop you. Or somebody was trying to block your singing or your rapping career. This was a wolf in sheep's clothing. Somebody was trying to stop your gifts. Somebody was trying to stop this, um, yeah, this gift that you had. And this this, pers this person was a wolf in sheep's clothing. You're being protected from that. They could be an Aries. That could be the Aries that you're being protected from. The one that was trying to stop your path. Now, you don't have to necessarily be a rapper or a singer. This can be whatever type of gift. Somebody here was trying to block your gifts. Okay. They were smiling in your face, but these were truly wolves in sheep's clothing, okay? Something something significant happened in May, okay? I feel like May and February, something significant happened in May. Your birthday could be in May or, or February, all right? Um, maybe you created something in May or February or, you know, with the singing and rap here, maybe you created an EP or, you, you know, you, you, you released something um, during May or during um, February, but I feel like you are very creative and you're being your 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 gift is being protected right now because you're you you're manifesting something big. I feel like you're about to blow up. I feel like you're really about to blow up. Somebody about to blow up here, okay? When it comes to their gifts, you a singer, you a rapper. I don't know what you do. You can be a, a poet. You can um, be an artist, a, 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 a painter. Um, you can be a, a hairstylist, a makeup artist, it's, it's some type of gift. Your gift is about to blow you up, but specifically singing and rapping. So if you're a singer or a rapper, you're about to go to another level. And it's because you have been manifesting this. Because you have been, look, perfectionist. You've been putting in the work. I feel like people wanted to stop you, but they don't understand how hard you work. You telling these people, please respect my grind, right? You are protected because of the way you work, because of your dedication, because you don't let nothing stop you. Okay, I'm seeing somebody here that has you. You you've been rejected a lot when it comes to singing and rapping, or it's like you you always you get to a point and then it, it something stops or something never fully works out or go through. But I feel like it it was because divine timing. You had you couldn't get to to be this big singer or this big rapper until you learned some type of lesson. 
until you got some type of wisdom and knowledge behind uh, this, this industry that you were going into. I feel like this year, you're, you're about to walk into an industry, but this you, you needed the wisdom. You needed the understanding. You needed the, 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 the knowledge of what was going on in this industry before you could literally uh, blow up. Mother wanted you to, 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 to understand what the arena that you was going into. You got your knowledge up. You perfected your craft. You perfected yourself. You went down a journey and you found and, and you and you found your, your gift, your purpose. You found your lyrics. Ah, come on. You went down a path and you found your lyrics. Mm. And now you are about to blow. And whoever this wolf in sheep's clothing was in the mid was was literally in the middle of stopping you. Like every blockage that was in your life, everything that, you know, things that went wrong or something, you were right there and it stopped. It was like this person, this wolf in sheep's clothing was in the middle of every stop, stop or, or blockage that that um that that you were presented with. Mind you, they were supposed to be. But their time is up now. Mother wants you to see this wolf in sheep's clothing, okay? I don't know, like I said, you could be the Aries or this could be the Aries or somebody could just be very controlling. So whoever this controlling energy is, they're the wolf. They were trying to control your gifts. They were trying to control where you go in life, how you blow up, your purpose. I'm seeing somebody here was like, maybe you had a manager. Mm. Your manager was a wolf in sheep's clothing, huh? Your manager didn't mean you know well. And this is what I'm saying. You had to get the understanding. You had to get the wisdom and knowledge. You had to go through some things before you got in the arena with the big dogs. Because then you can really be played. Then you can really be misled. Then you can really be manipulated. Yeah, this wolf in sheep's clothing, was, it was something light. So you can learn the lesson, get what you need to get, and know how to move with these people, with these snakes and these frauds. Because you're going into an industry with snakes and frauds. Don't get it, don't get it twisted. When you are a singer and a rapper and you're about to go into this industry, it's a bunch of snakes and a bunch of frauds. So you gotta be careful. You gotta be able to protect yourself. And this is why mother wants you to do, get some sigils. Some sigils of protection around you. So even when you go into meetings, because I'm seeing that somebody's about to go into meetings. You're about, somebody's going to blow and very fast. I'm getting that. Because I'm hearing um, Jasmine Sullivan's song. I got a dream, B. Because when it happens, it's going to happen real quick. Yes, I feel it. I got to I gotta move fast. Yeah. Something is going to move fast. So mother wants you to, to, to get some sigils so you can carry them with you when you go to, to your meetings. So you can carry it in your pocket or just the, the extra protection. Because you're about to, you're literally about to, to um, be in a room full of wolves. A room full of hungry ass people that's looking for their next meal. That's looking for the next person they, that they can devour. Yeah, a woman's worth. You know your worth. This is gonna be. You can be. A, it can be a female, a female singer or a rapper that's about to blow. And it's like you had to learn your worth. You had to learn your worth. Yeah. So that and I. You know what? And that's what it is. You're about to be discovered. G three. Okay, rapper, singer, whatever gifts you have, you're about to be discovered and pushed in the limelight. Congratulations, my beautiful G3. Now, let me get some um, advice for you at this time. I'm so excited for you. I'm so happy for you. All of your hard work has paid off, okay? Um, I feel like you was, at a, oh, you was at a point where you were going to stop. I feel like you was at a point where you were going to give up on this dream, you know? And I feel like mother had to show you and remind you who you were and remind you of your, your gifts. Like, I feel like mother had to reawaken your sense, your sense of, 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 um,
creativity. Yeah, I feel like, you know, you, maybe somebody lost their creative niche or, you know, but I feel like because you, it was a lot of pressure, right? You under a lot of pressure, dealing with so many things um, in life outside of yourself, you know, just, just all of the stuff that life has to offer. You, you, you were just going through a lot and you put your dreams, you put yourself, you put your gifts on the back burner. Mother said, no, go pick those dreams up. Go pick that gift up because this dream and this gift is really going to catapult you in the position, in a place that you want to be. It's going to, like you're going to take off like a rocket. This is what's going on, the countdown. It's a countdown to your takeoff. Okay? Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. <laughs> six. Five. Be proud of yourself. Be proud of yourself. This gift, I feel like you, you really... You really did what you had to do. Like, you really perfected this gift. You practiced. Um, when I went to Berkeley College of Music, those, um, I don't know if they were Chinese or Korean, in all respect, much respect, no shade, no, just all love, you know what I'm saying? But um, those Chinese people, they were in that practice room all day. Like, they did not leave. And they were so beasty behind their instruments. I'm telling you, these, these, I don't like, I thought, no, they were Chinese or Korean. All I know is that they did not play when it came to their craft, when it came to their gift. And the, their parents didn't play either, like, <laughs> and let me tell you, these people were master mu musicians. Master! Master piano players. Master drummers. Master, um, uh, uh, what is it? Guitar players, master bass players. They were masters at their craft because they perfected it. And I feel like that's the, the, the type of time that you was on when it came to your gift, when it came to this singing, when it came to this rapping, when it came to whatever you wanted to do. You mastered it. And I feel like mother wanted you to master something before she put you in the spotlight. Maybe you had to master this understanding and this wisdom and this knowledge of the arena that you were going into. Because I feel like somebody's gifts come natural. This gift that you have is just a natural thing. What you had to master was how to move in a room full of hoes. What you had to master was how to, how to move in a room full of snakes. Yeah. And being that you've mastered that, you learned your lesson. You, you, you was able to pick out the wolf in sheep's clothing that was in your crew. And mother, and that was the test. Mother wanted to see, are you going to be able to see this wolf? Are you going to be able to recognize this wolf? And most importantly, are you going to be able to release and, and detach from this wolf? You passed the test, G3. And because you did that, and because you mastered this, this understanding, this wisdom, this knowledge, this craft of yours, now you move to the next level. Now you're in the spotlight. Now I'm saying somebody's about to be on TV. You're, you, I don't know, your song, your music, what you got to say is about to be heard for real. You about to be heard. <laughs> I used to tell people, yo, it's almost time for me to be heard. I used to always say that. So much that other people try to talk, try to start saying it. <laughs> no, baby, it's time for G3 to be heard. And G3, nothing going to stop that, baby. You mastered. You, you won. Ooh, and you a beast at what you do. I, I'm hearing mother say, you, you really, are, you the best at what you do. You really good at what you do. You really good at this singing. You really good at this rapping. You really good at this 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 writing. You really good at this drawing. You really good at at whatever you do. Whatever this gift it is, you're really good at it. It's really it's natural. It, it's embedded. It's embedded in your in your in your DNA in your coding. So yeah, you do it so good. So yeah, it wasn't it wasn't your it wasn't your gift that you had to master. It was the knowledge the wisdom and the understanding behind what you were getting yourself into that you needed to master. But you did that. And now you're moving to the next level. Attuned to the divine. Yes, mother is saying, keep your eyes on me and you good. Okay, I could be talking to a Pisces, a Virgo, very spiritual, very spiritual journey, very spiritual path. Um, uh, 
very psychic too. So I can be talking to a psychic, you know, um, that can be a, one of your gifts too. You can be a tarot reader, you can be an oracle, you can be a psychic, you can be a psychic medium. However this thing go, I feel like somebody here is very psychic, very in tune with the divine, very connected to nature, okay? Um, I could be talking to a Virgo. It's time to take inspired actions. Virgo doing a whole lot of thinking. Virgo always want to, want to, oh, you, you, you a Virgo. That's why you're a perfectionist. Yeah. I feel like maybe you're in your head a lot, but it's time to take action. I feel like somebody's like, oh, I'm not, maybe I'm too old to do something or I'm too young to do something or my time is up. I feel like I'm hearing a whole lot of down talking and downplaying yourself. You got a gift. Stop playing with yourself. Okay. I could be talking to a Scorpio. Reveal what needs to be seen. And what is that mother? What needs to be seen? This gift. Now it's time for this gift to be seen. Now it's time for you to be seen. And not only seen, but heard, okay? I could be talking to an Aries. Like I said, there goes that Aries again. Aries, cool your emotions. Whether this was that Aries that was a wolf in sheep's clothing, this Aries is, is, is tight. Whoever was trying to manipulate you or control you is, is tight because they can no longer control you. They're so upset. They're trying to cool their emotions. They're trying to calm themselves down, but they can't. Every time they think about you, they get all hot and bothered. They get angry. Because whatever they were trying to do, whatever they, whatever they was trying to block, whatever they was trying to stop, did not work. Did not work. You're still about to be on TV. You're still about to be on the radio. You're still about to be heard. You're still about to be bright. You're still about to shine. You're, the, you're, you're going to be the brightest light. Somebody here is going to be the brightest light in every room. Believe in your good luck. Luck is on your side. All you got to do is believe in that. All you got, I could be talking to a Sagittarius. All you got to do is believe that luck is on your side. No, I'm not lucky. I'm blessed. Yes, clap for the heavyweight champ, me. But I couldn't do it all alone. We, young money raised me, blew about and saved me. South Side Jamaica, Queens, this is, and it's crazy. Uh, Hollywood couldn't change me. Ah! I'm being vindicated. Ah! I don't know. This might just remind me of everything they deprived me of. Yeah, yeah. Put your drinks up. It's a celebration every time we link up. <laughs> Greatness is what we want to bring up. I wish that I can have this moment for life. Okay, I F that all up, but that's my song, okay? <laughs> Listen to that. Listen to that today. Listen to that. Whatever you hear this video, okay? Put on Moment for Life because I feel like that's what you're about to have. And this is not, it's not about to be 15 minutes of fame. Nah. Your 15 minutes, this is going to be the longest 15 minutes that, uh, of, of your life, okay? I wish that I can have this moment for life. Hey. For life. Hey. Ah. For life. Because ah. in this moment, I just feel so alive. Alive. Oh, you're gonna feel so I'm so happy for you, G3. You did it, you did it. You almost gave up, and I'm glad that you did it. You almost gave up, but that'd be life, right? You be right there, you be right there, and you be like, F it. But you didn't do that. You was right there and you said F it, but you kept walking. But you kept doing what you had to do. Every time you said, F it, I'm not doing that, you still continue to do what you were supposed to do. You still continue to stay in alignment and on the path. No matter what. You could have stopped. You, like I said, I, somebody, I feel like so, it was so much going on in somebody's life that they couldn't focus on their gift. They couldn't focus on this, this, uh, this, they had, it was like a side hustle. Your gift, your purpose was a side hustle in your life. And you was putting everything else before it. And you're not, and, 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 and I feel like you you realize this. I, I'm under so much pressure. I, it's so much going on in my life, and it's I I I got I gotta take some time to myself. I'm gonna lose my mind. But that was your intuition telling you, uh, hello, it's time to focus on self. It's time to focus on what we what we do best. Okay, your mother mother wants you to do what you do best. Yeah, do what you do best, G3. Love you so much. Thank you guys so, so much for tuning in. Mm. My throat. Thank you so, 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 so much for tuning in. If you got anything from this message and you want to leave your girl a donation, all my information is down below. And what did I, number did I end up for? Five. Four. This is a countdown. Three. 
two, one. You about to blow. <laughs> Love you guys.